What's going on, y'all? It's your boy, Sean Robert Johnson. As you know, I'm incarcerated at New Jersey State Prison in Trent, New Jersey. I appreciate y'all tuning in to today's episode that we got for y'all, so let's just get straight to it. Welcome back to another episode of Prison Audio with Sean Robert Johnson. That's me, your guy. Unfortunately, you know, I'm in prison. I have been for the last 17 years. But, you know, make the best of it the best way you can and just continue to push forward every day. So today is January 16th, 2024. I'm 16 days in on my Daniel Fast that I was telling you all about uh, a couple of weeks ago when we had did a focus episode. So 16 days in, eating nothing but potatoes, vegetables, beans, and fruits, and peanut butter. That's what I've really been eating for the most part. So it's been coming along good. It's about like my 14th time of doing it. So I definitely like to do it. You know, get into the word a lot more. All right, so what I wanted to do was talk about today is how we are able to do certain things as far as trying to create content while I'm right here in prison. And I try to think of different ideas to do different things because I understand the power of social media and how it is. And I understand that all it takes is one person to send you viral. If you break the algorithm, whether you're on Instagram, YouTube, TikTok, uh, Twitter, now known as X, or whatever the case may be. And I try to be innovative, just come up with these dope things that I think that people can relate to in different ways. All right, so recently I had created a video on the JPEG. And I remember my bro Mike was telling y'all before about JPEG, how you can log on to a person, JPEG, and all that. So on JPEG, not only are we able to send and receive messages, we're also able to send, uh, receive photos. We're also able to receive 30-second videos and send 30-second videos, all right? So maybe a couple of weeks ago, I had an idea that it's around the time that we get food package, which means that we can get food from the streets. We get a vendor that we can order different stuff, whether it's like uh, Popeye's, whether it's Little Debbie stuff, Dunkin' Donuts stuff, or like name brand foods that y'all can get at the store every day. So here in this prison, we do that every six months. So we do it about twice a year. Other prisons is different. Some prisons, they're able to order it once a month, and they only got a certain limit of things that they can order as far as money-wise or pounds. Some prisons do it every three months, but we do it every six months. And it doesn't matter how much money you can spend on it, but you can't spend over 60 pounds. So that's just what it is. So I had the idea of saying, okay, let me utilize the products that we can order from the streets as part of content creation. And one of the ideas that I came up with doing a little mini Dunkin' Donuts type commercial while being here in prison. So I created the video, and now I'm going to let Mike put it together right now and show you all the video for what I did. When it comes to one of my favorite donuts that I always get, it's the apple crumb donut because it got the crumb on the top and it got the apple filling in the middle, right? This is definitely one of my favorite donuts I always get. So my name is Sean Robert Johnson, and I want to let you know that I run on Duncan, even though I'm in prison. Now, as you can see, I'm sitting here trying to do a Dunkin' Donuts commercial in that video right there. And the slogan is, even in prison, we still run on Dunkin'. And the funny thing is, I remember that I had this video right here posted on my Instagram. Mike had sent it to my Instagram. My mom had took it. No, my son had took it and posted it on my Instagram. And somebody that I actually know, I talked to maybe a week after that, and they said, yo, I seen that video that you did about Dunkin' Donuts. Matter of fact, the next day I went and bought the same exact donut that you was talking about and eating in the video. And that's part of content creation and being an influence in there. All right, so the next video that I also did that I had the same thing in mind was stuff about Little Debbie. 
So I'm going to let Mike play this video now. In prison, you know, we get a lot of different commissaries. So this is a chicken flavor soup that we get, the Roman noodles. They cost like a dollar. And they cost like 30 cents, my bad. These right here are the honey buns that we get right here on Canteen. They cost a dollar nine. These are the generic cookies that we get, cost a dollar fifty five. They almost like the Oreos that we get. Then we got the sitting different kind of nachos that we get. These right here cost like a dollar and fifty. And then on top of that we got the Moon Lodge regular plain. Alright, so this right here was based on the advertisement of Little Debbie products, but basically asking people out of those snacks of Little Debbie that I showed in this video, which ones would you prefer? Part of influencing, part of content creation as well. And that one right there, it got it got a, a modest amount of views on my Instagram. But, you know, I just try to create different names. And then the last video is about stuff that we can buy on a commissary right here in the prison I'm at. And it's generic stuff. Everything is generic name, brand. I'm quite sure on the street shall have generic stuff as well. But this one right here, you will see of what I'm talking about. So as you see in this video, it's a ramen noodle soup. It's a pack of cookies. It's a pack of nachos, a pack of uh, a bag of nachos, and a bag of some chips. And these are generic brands that for the most part is only made for people in prison especially like the cookies and everything else but i know the ramen noodles i know they get them they get them on the streets everywhere so like that's kind of a name brand and i just gave you the price of what we pay for them because i just wanted y'all to know so this is what we do behind the scenes just talk about stuff and try to come up with different content creation in regards to Use it, utilizing the environment that I have in prison of what we can do with the stuff that we have in here. So just wanted to just give y'all a quick, quick little rundown about that right there. And if you have any questions, any comments, then just call 1-800-366-0911. That's 1-800-366-0911. Or send an email to stories at prisonaudio.com. That's S T O R I E S, the at sign, P R I S O N A U D I O dot com. And if you are not a subscriber on our YouTube pages, then please become a subscriber. Become a subscriber at Prison Audio. That's the at sign, P R I S O N A U D I O. And also, Become a subscriber on our other YouTube channels at Sean Robert Johnson. That's the at sign S H A W N R O B E R T J O H N S O N. And leave your comment if you're on YouTube. If you're already a subscriber on there, it's free. Whether you're on Spotify, whether you're on uh, Apple Music, whether you're on App Prison Audio, at Sean Robert Johnson, it's free. Become a subscriber, listen to the content that we give you. And if you ever want to hit me up directly because I guess you want to chop it up with me, you can hit me up on the JPay. Mike showed y'all in the episode of how to do it, but you can go to JPay.com, that's J-P-A-Y.com, or you could download the JPay app, that's J-P-A-Y. And once you get on the app, all you do is come on my contact list, put my name in, S-H-A-W-N, J-O-H-N-S-O-N. My number that you put in is 732-464-C in the state of New Jersey, right there. And you'll be able to converse with me directly. Well, other than that, everybody, thank you for tuning in to another episode of Prison Audio. We're Sean Robert Johnson. That's me. Stay focused. Stay blessed. Keep moving forward. Accomplish something great in your life today. And tune in to the next episode coming soon. I appreciate y'all tuning in today's episode. Y'all always showing love and support by tuning in. So continue to do so. Continue to share the link. And we're going to continue to bring y'all the best content that we can. Have a blessed day.